iguana. All right, guys, we're back at this park at the same iguana tree. There's almost always an iguana on this bare branch. He's all the way towards the back, sitting in the sun, bright green with some orange spikes. see it? Okay, I'm gonna pull this guy down. Oh, the school there. Pull this guy in real quick. Dang it, don't twist up my stuff. The other one's still there. The other one's still there. Got you, Iguana. We got him right here. We're gonna try and get the second one before it gets away. He has no tail. He has like a half tail or something. Somebody try to take a bite of him. Oh, my new pole is messing up. Look at my snow. doing it because of the tape. Sitting still. green one. See, he's the one with the half tail we saw on the tree. Nice green one with his orange spikes. Yeah, let's bring him in the sunlight. And they both have their fancy little peach faces because we're in breeding season. Good looking guys right here. They got their fat cheeks going on. That's why I couldn't get it over his head. He got caught up right here on his jaw, so all you had to do is shake his head down and it comes the noose comes off. Got you iguanas.
got it around her neck. This is the big female I was talking about. I think it's a girl. Just from looking at it from a distance, mainly because her spikes are so small for her size. A big male right now would be real spiky during breeding season. So you can see there's a girl. She doesn't have big white dots here, which would be the femoral pores indicating a male. So there's a girl. She should have small developing eggs at this time of year. So there's a big girl. Got two iguana. He got her. It's another really big female. Ooh, she's a fatty. She's a good girl to pull out. Definitely like a 50, 60 egg layer right there. So somebody will eat her tonight. She got a big old fat tail ready to lay some eggs. Somebody took the end of it. She got that nice little double tail going on. Here you can see. That happens when their tail breaks unevenly. Look at the head on that. That's an older girl. She's got to be... I hate to estimate ages, but if you had one as a pet, she wouldn't get this big till she was at least six or seven. If not older, it seems. She's a big girl. Got you, Iguana. All right, we're going to take a picture for the client of the uh, Iguanas that we got here just now. So we got four out by the water and we got two out of that tree when we first showed up. The two in the tree looked big until we went out by the water. These ones in the water are absolute monsters. These are huge girls here. These are some young boys. These two, you could compare them to this guy. Totally different. I want to get on the other side because of the light. They're both scarred up from fighting recently though. This guy's got a nice bite. That's got a little bit of infection, a few scars. So there you have it. Our catch, we've probably been here about 30, 45 minutes. Six iguanas ain't bad. Iguana solution. Iguana. Just pulled up at the customer's house. This guy was waiting for us on the bush as we pulled up, and we already got him. One down, quite a few more to go. Iguana solution. He is feisty. Ah. These boys are out. They're like all male that we're catching. He is nice and bright, huh?
right, there's a monster iguana over here. I'm gonna walk this way because of that loud pump. There's a pretty big iguana whenever we go around this corner. There's an oak tree. We want to walk up on it kind of quickly because if we come up too slowly, he'll slowly work his way down the branch and we can't get to him. So we're gonna kind of walk up quickly until I get within range, hopefully. I'm not even sure I can reach him. We spotted him from across the lake. I don't think so. They're not pumping sewage into this pond. That'd be illegal. There's also a really big green iguana on that branch going out towards the water right now. Real good size green one. Ow, Swatch, what you doing? He ran in there? Almost seemed like you did that on.
dummy. You should have swam off. Got you, iguana. They got that big boy. I spotted him from across the lake. Pulled him out the tree. He got off, but we got him anyway. Iguana Solutions.